on the way up, I don't feel scared. <laughs> it's more of when I get to that age, I start feeling it. <laughs> so you stand there, it's a, okay, I should go now. <laughs> then your body don't go, then you, okay, go. Okay, go. <laughs> Do you always feel scared? I don't think you get over the fear. I think you get used to the fear. <laughs> Very compact and tidy from Jonathan Chan of Singapore. I think at the start, it was definitely the fun. Like the thrill of like flipping a few times before entering the water was what kept me there lah. Then it got harder and more competitive and scarier. I think other than my teammates, I think it was more of a, I don't have a good reason to quit. <laughs> if we quit, then we wouldn't reach her. I think it's just like the staying and just doing every day, even if you don't enjoy it. Just coming back even when you hate it and then you get past that and continue is how you get further law. For me, it was not, not so much of I'm gonna gun for Olympics since the start. It's more of as I slowly improved, like step by step, now I was like, oh, actually now I'm within reach. So why not reach for it? Lah? Yeah. I think this Olympics will be quite special because it's my first and likely last Olympics that I'll be going for. Lah. As I graduate this year, I'm not sure whether I have enough time to keep up with both diving and whatever comes next. Lah. I think pandemic-wise, still of course a bit scared. Lah. Like It definitely comes with risk, but one thing that helped during COVID was Sports Hub, they actually closed down the whole aquatic center to the public, so it's only like national team people can come in. So that one definitely helped to settle some fears. I mean, yeah lah, if you are from outsider, you're like, ah yeah, it's dangerous, don't go lor, just cancel. It's just sian, cause, because they don't know how much effort you put into it. All that effort, if you don't get to compete at that, that stage or like that level, will be very disappointing lor. I guess the other thing is, if this whole game can go well without any outbreaks happening, it's a good point to show like, even in a pandemic, things can happen if everyone follows the rules. Lah. It's a sign that it's possible. I think my main goal for this Olympics is really to try and enjoy the sport again. Rather than like stressing myself out and overthinking, saying like, oh, you know, this might, might be my only Olympics. I have to do the best that I can do or not. It's wasted. No matter what happens, I technically made it there already. Lah. And I don't need to prove to myself or anybody else that I have to win it or whatever. Beyond Olympics, I hope that other people can, can see lah and like know that it's possible for like us athletes in Singapore to reach this kind of standard. And like, I wouldn't say it's easy, but it's possible lah. Oh yeah, then I think got Charles coming up for diving, so can come and try if you want. <laughs> it's possible. <laughs>